I love gardening. It makes me happy. The world isn't always pretty, but you can make it pretty. I'm retired now. I was a school teacher. People told me I was one of the best. <laughs> I think I was too. I loved the education part of teaching. But the thing I loved most were the kids. Everyone said I had a knack for picking out the kids with the most potential. The ones that will go far in life. I haven't been wrong yet. I didn't do much. I just made sure they reached their potential. I nourished them, if you will. I praised them for doing well and withdrew praise if they could have done better. I encouraged them continuously. And through it, I watched them bloom into the people they were meant to become. I think that's why I like gardening. You can take a little sprout, plant it in the soil, and nourish it with water and sun. Each day, you watch it grow, until finally it reaches its full potential. If a flower doesn't grow, it's because of its environment. To help your little darling, you need to remove the weed around it, pull it from its roots so it can never grow back again. Once a plant has gone bad, it can't become good again. If it rots on the surface, it's rotten at its core. Dear Miss May, <laughs> is it funny I still call you Miss May after all these years? It took me a while, but after calling a string of different schools, I finally tracked down your address. I don't know if you remember me, but I was in your class years ago. My daughter just started third grade, the same grade I was when you were my teacher. She came home crying the other day, saying someone bullied her at school. It made me think of you. And that day, Benji pushed me down at recess. I saw you watching us from the window, so I ran to you. I remember him crying when you told him to stay after class. The next day, Benji wasn't at school. You said he was told to stay home for a week. I'll never forget what you said next. You grabbed my hand, looked me in the eye, and told me I should never let anyone get in the way of my potential. I think Benji moved or something after that, but after him, I didn't let anyone push me around again. It took me having a child of my own to realize it, but you really were the best. You saw me for what I could be. You are the most caring, patient, tender-hearted person. I can only hope my daughter has a teacher like you. Hey, May. How's the garden? 
плюнь